A child of God, what have you lost? What are the things that may have been taken away from you? Today I decree and I declare that you shall recover all in the mighty name of Jesus. That thief has been caught. And whatever it is that was taken away from you, dear child of God, you shall recover all in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You see, some things that David had labored for, some things that David had possessed, the enemies came and took them all. Dear child of God, he was distressed, yes. He was in pain, he was in the heaviness of heart. Just like you are in right now, the things you have labored for, the enemies have come to snatch them from you. Your blessings, the things you worked for night and day, somehow you have lost them. Today I decree and I declare that there will be a complete recovery in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. And you would have reasons to rejoice in Jesus' mighty name. I decree and I declare it again. There will be a complete recovery in the mighty name of Jesus. You see, everything that David had lost, there was complete recovery of everything. The word of God in 1 Samuel 30 verse 18 says, and David got back. He says, David got back everything. He says, everything the Amalekites had taken. He says, he got back everything. He recovered everything. The scripture says, David rescued everyone. Dear child of God, he says, David recovered all. Today, you shall recover all in the mighty name of Jesus. What are those things that was taken away from you? You shall recover all in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. The word of God stated very clear. There was no loss of anything, my God. Since there was no loss of anything, both small and great. He says sons and daughters, goods or anything which were taken away. He says David got it all back. Dear child of God, there shall be no loss in the mighty name of Jesus. You will not count to losses in the mighty name of Jesus. Such as the armies came and told Moses, we have numbered the people. The captains of the army came and said, we have numbered the people and there is no man that is lost. It says everyone are numbered. Everyone are accounted for. Dear child of God, so you would have your testimonies in the mighty name of Jesus. God told Paul that there will be no loss. There will be no loss of life. And so it was at the end of the day everyone was counted this is how it's going to be for you today everything that i consent to you you will not lose in the mighty name of jesus christ this is nothing of theirs was missing dear child of god this is nothing of theirs was missing this day i decree and declare to you dear child of god that nothing of yours would be missing in the mighty name of jesus you would walk through the year and discover everything that you have worked for, everything that you have labored for, have all been intact because the protective arms of God will be over them in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You will not have reasons to mourn. You will not have reasons to sorrow, dear child of God. You will not have reasons to lament because of losses in the mighty name of Jesus. Believe God, for he will bring this world to pass in the mighty name of Jesus. It says, whether small or large, whether great or small, none was lost. Everything was preserved. Everything was kept. Dear child of God, to the littlest of things that you have in your possessions, there will be no loss in the mighty name of Jesus. There shall be no losses in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. And if it seems like you have experienced losses before now, dear child of God, I pray for complete recovery in the mighty name of Jesus. Complete recovery of everything that you have lost in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. God will make sure you would have no reason to sorrow. God will make sure you would have no reason to cry. God will make sure you would have no reason to lament in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You will not lack what you need in your life in the mighty name of Jesus. You see the word of God in Psalms 34 verse 10 says, the young lions are in need and have no food. But he says, those who are looking to the Lord would have everything good. He says, those who are looking for the Lord. He says, those who are looking up to God. 
He says those who have faith in God would have nothing in their lives that they are lacking. Your child of God, this will be your testimony. You will look all around you and you will say there is nothing I am lacking. In marriage, everything shall be flourishing. Dear child of God, in your health, everything shall be intact. Dear child of God, in your businesses and finances, everything shall be in order. Everything shall be in order in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. It says those who put their faith in God, those who trust in God, says they will lack no good thing. They will never lack anything. That is, there will be no time in their life that something will be missing. That is, there will be no time, there will be no moment in their life that they will be searching for the things that they are supposed to have. Dear child of God, everything that you need, the basic thing that you are supposed to have as a child of God, as somebody who is committed and diligent to their work, you would have in the mighty name of Jesus. This is those who seek the Lord, lack no good thing. Dear child of God, keep seeking the Lord and the things you are supposed to have, you would have in the mighty name of Jesus. Dear child of God, keep seeking the Lord and you will not lose anything in the mighty name of Jesus. God is on your side to help you. God is on your side to make everything good for you. And I assure you by the grace of God, by the mercies of God, by the hand of God, everything you need in your life, He will provide them. He will provide them in the mighty name of Jesus. God will cause you to be strong. God will cause you to be satisfied on all sides in the mighty name of Jesus. The things that causes your heart to rejoice, God will bring them your way in abundance in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Have you lost some years? Today, God will make sure there will be a recovery in the mighty name of Jesus. He said the years that the palmer ones have eaten up. He says the years that the swarming locusts have taken from you, there shall be a recovery of them all. Today, I pray there will be a recovery of everything that you may have lost in the mighty name of Jesus. You will redeem everything that matters to you. The word of God says, redeeming the times for the days are evil. Dear child of God, have you lost some times? Maybe in your childhood days, maybe in your younger days, because of wrong decisions. Today, there shall be a recovery of those times in the mighty name of Jesus. And you will discover that, discover that God will bring growth your way in the mighty name of Jesus. God would accelerate your growth in the mighty name of Jesus. God would accelerate your growth in the mighty name of Jesus. For the things that you have lost, for the things that you have prayed for, for the things that you have suffered, there will be a recovery in the mighty name of Jesus. And this is how God will set to you. This is how God will make your joy full. This is how God will bring you to your place of rest in the mighty name of Jesus. You have served God. You have been faithful. And he's saying to you today, there shall be a recovery of everything. You see, when the thief is caught, the scriptures recorded that seven times over will be restored. It would make sure that the thief, yes, and today the devil has been caught. He who has come to steal, to kill, and to destroy, who has come to take the things that are precious to you, he has been caught. And there will be a recovery of everything that you have lost. Dear child of God, there will be a recovery of everything that you have been seeking. Dear child of God, there will be a recovery of everything that matters to your heart. Trust God is faithful and he will make sure he does this and your mouth shall be filled with praises and thanksgiving in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. God will make sure that you recover all things in the name of Jesus Christ. You will testify of the recovery. Dear child of God, you will testify of the recoveries in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. It is settled with you. It is settled with your family, dear child of God. It is settled with everything that I concern to you in Jesus' mighty name. So have no fear in you anymore because there shall be a recovery. They'll be coming back to you. Maybe some relationship, dear child of God. As long as God had destiny to be from the beginning, that relationship will be restored and it shall be flourishing in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Your children, may have worked out on you, dear child of God. God will make sure that they are restored back unto you. God will make sure that they return back to you and your joy shall be full in the mighty name of Jesus. I promise to do this and nothing will stop it. Nothing will ever stop it from happening in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I call it done. 
because it is settled. And Jehovah, who is watching over you, who had promised to bless you, will bless you exceedingly in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. I call it on because it is settled in Jesus' name. Amen. It is well with you, beloved. God bless you and shalom.